best save? Uh, probably a, a double save I made um, from the penalty spot at Cardiff in Stoke City's promotion season. Well, Rangers Football Club's Rangers Football Club. Um, you know, it's renowned worldwide in football. Um, and as soon as there was interest from them, it was it was an absolute no-brainer to join Rangers and be part of this incredible football club. There's been a few interesting ones, um, but in in terms of being a little bit quaint and for me really likable, I enjoyed Breakin. Um, it was just something about it that it was just it was just a quite an enjoyable little ground. Oh, best player I've played with. Um, I'd have to say an ex-Ranger ex player. I played with him at Everton, um, Paul Gascoigne. Um, you know, I don't really need to say too much about Gaza. Top, top bloke and fantastic footballer. I've, I've, I've had a lot of good memories of all the clubs I've played for. Um, probably my very best is, is winning promotion to the, the Premier League with Stoke City. Phenomenal achievements and very, very special day to, to win promotion to the Premier League. I've really taken a liking in the last sort of five or six years to um, Roger Federer who um, is obviously a multiple champion of Wimbledon and many, many other titles as well. Um, such a cool, cool guy. Nothing phases him. Top, top sportsman. Delighted, absolutely delighted that, um, that a huge club like Rangers had any interest at all, I think, when, you, when you're getting on in your career, um, you know, you think the chance to join Huge clubs like Rangers has passed you by, so it was it was an absolute dream for me. Fans, I, I'm in awe of the fans at, at this football club. You know, the support at the home games and, and the away games is, is incredible. Um, the fans have been utterly fantastic in the, the short time that I've been here. <laughs> Do you know what? I can't I can't get away from her because she works on a. Um, a radio station in Liverpool on a breakfast show, so I'm always getting various texts or calls to say that she's um, she's let something slip every morning. So I'm always never far away from my mouth. <laughs> Do I plan on going to coaching? Um, absolutely, yes. Gained valuable experience through the years, um, and I'd, I'd love to pass it on to to younger goalkeepers and help them improve their game. Best prankster. Um, I've not really been on the end of any pranks yet, so I'm hopefully I'm not tempting fate with this one, but um, from what I've seen so far, maybe Stephen Smith. Um, and I think in terms of banter, I think, um, you know, Glaswegians and, and Scottish people in general have uh, generally got really good banter. Any player in the world? Um, probably an obvious one, but um, Lionel Messi, um, basically, for the, the same reasons that everybody else would want to bring him to the football club. He'd probably score about 300 goals a season. Do you know what, Duncan's a pussycat. <laughs> the only other person as scary as, as, as Big Dunk would probably be Abel Xavier, who is the sort of person you definitely wouldn't want to meet on a dark night. <laughs> uh, yeah, confused with John Bishop. Um, do you know what, that started just when he started becoming famous. Um, I'd never heard of him. People kept saying, oh, you look like John Bishop. Um, but it, it's, it's, it's become quite funny because I, I live in that area, so I, I get it quite a lot. The best part is that I get confused with being his younger brother, which is, which is the best bit. Maybe that's the bit to put in, I think. He's a good 10 to 15 years older than me. Yeah, I worked with Chris Woods for six years at Everton, um, and it wasn't just him. There was there was Walter Smith and Archie as well that were that were at Everton, along with uh, Goffey, Alex Cleland, Davy Weir. So I've had many many influences on Rangers, and um, each and every one of them has only had good things to say about the football club. Probably the running part of, of being an outfield player. Um, I was, ne I'm ne I was never been a good runner, so that was the. And I was actually found. I actually found I was good at playing in goals, so um, that was the major benefactor, really. Best goalkeeper and hero of all time. I grew up in the Neville Southall era, um, so for me, he was. He was always the best goalkeeper out there at the time for me. Um, 
it was an honour to be able to, to work with him for a short period at Everton when I was there. No, I, I, I'm his younger, his younger not twin brother. Um, I don't know, I mean, I can't see a likeness, but um, I have to stress I'm a lot younger than him. Home back four from World Football. Um, I would definitely have Leighton Baines at left back. Um, fantastic player, seen a lot of him at Everton, brilliant. Centre backs, I, I really like Philipp Lahm, who's a German international by Munich. Uh, I also like Piquet from Barcelona, he's another very good defender, good on the ball, just above Big Jig, only just though. If I could fit Sergio Ramos in as well, I'd get him in there as well. Uh, I might have to jiggle him around a little bit, but um, he's another good player and uh, I wouldn't mind being behind that back four.